So I'm here at uh, Coulson's Wharf Park in Yandina. It's on the North Maruti River. And it's um, back in the 1890s when the train came to town. People used to come down here and catch a boat all the way to Maruti Door down the Maruti River. So it's probably been metal detected to death. But we just found an old rail line down near the water, which I'll show you later. A hundred year old rail line sitting down there. But it's a beautiful park. River is down there a little bit. And lots of trees. Hopefully we find some relics or old coins. All I've found so far is a bit of old can and an old bottle top. But uh, we'll come back to you. Hopefully we find something good. Otherwise it's going to be a very short video. So I've got a 12.47 in this hole. All I've found so far is um, ring pulls and bottle tops. So I'm hoping this one's better. It seems to be out. And there it is there in the mound. Got a bit of a scratch around. Oh, there it is. It's a coin. It's a coin. It's a shilling. It's an old one, which is good. Because you can see the king on it. Probably not. There it is there. 1917 Australian silver shilling. That's the oldest shilling I've found, so I'm really wrapped about that. That's a bucket lister. So, good sign. But probably no one's metal detected this park then, so I'm wrapped. So, come back to you with the next one. Only a couple of feet away from the shilling, which was here, I've got a 12.39 in here. Uh, could be a copper. Could be a copper signal, but we'll wait and see. Unfortunately, it looks like junk. Looks like a bit of rustiness in there. Rusty iron. Which it is. A bit rusted something. And uh, we knew what that was. Looks like an old gear. But um, unfortunately, not a coin. Okay, um, not the best of signals, 1232. 1232 is normally not old silver. On the CTX in the 40s for the silver. But um, you never know. We'll dig it and have a look. See what we're going to add to our bottle top collection. There it is. It is a coin. Coin or button? It's a button. It's an old brass button, I think. Or it's an. Might even be a camping eyelet. Don't know, I'll have to clean that one up and. No. It's not a button. Not sure what that is. Might be off canvas. So uh, we'll clean that up later. Just down this bit of a gully heading to the river. You can see the rocks, but if you can see the old old train tracks or trolley tracks, probably a tram car back in the day probably came right here and this is where Coulson's Wharf used to be. You can see the, the track along there. When we get down a bit further you can see the old sleeper and the track on the other side. And there's the North Maruchi River. So they used to come down here catch the ferry all the way to Maruchidor so people come up on the train from Brisbane to Yandina there was the ferry boat to pick them up here take them to Maruchidor for the day beautiful spot there's some kids down here fishing before and they had a nice brim but beautiful spot so this is why we came here because it's so old Yandina and this part very old so really wrapped to find the shilling soil's really good it was, uh, hasn't rained for about four months and then we got an inch of rain during the week so it softened it up which is great um, you can see the tree roots go right over the, the old track so really good spot let's hope we find some more relics or coins back soon so guys in this hole here um, had a 12, 13. No, it's not the best number, but I decided to dig it. Got the tiniest little sinker. So, on the riverbank. 
you can see down there there's the water and there's basically sand so very easy digging let's hope we get a few coins rather than sinkers so guys not far just a couple of feet from that little sinker which was there and the tram tracks are down there I've got a 12.42 in here, it's, but it seems quite large, so I'm thinking maybe not a coin, but um, have a bit of a, a bit of a look. Let's see. You know what happens when we do a live dig? It's always, always junk. So let's hope we turn it around. Okay, we'll see you again. It's up there, up on the side. I'll turn this off and I'll find and come back to you. And I was right, whenever we do a live dig, the old 4X can. So I said it was a big target, and that's what it was. So, finding lots of old iron. As you can see from that, it looks like an old wheel or bearing. Big iron. So there's lots of it here. It's about the eighth piece I've found. But um, you've got to keep digging, because you don't know what's down there. So, uh, in this hole here, Reading at 12.32, I just um, found this thing. I think it might be a valve stem off a Model T. I don't know. Could be a screwdriver handle. But we're going to clean that up and have a good look at it later on. But that's what it's looking like. Um, could be wrong. And this one you can see here, it was basically just under the leaves. Read at 12.42. It's old, but I don't know if it's really, really old. But um, we'll clean it up. Hopefully there's a fitting or a maker's mark on it. Brass. We'll see how we go. So in this hole we had a 12.15. And it's a lure. Fishing lure. Bladed spinner. Big hook on it. So. Stone. This is a fishing sinker. It's a bit of lead, it's a lead sinker. So guys, just doing a bit of a wrap up. Typical park, lots of trash. Not much treasure. Bottle caps, ring pulls. A couple of these, I think they must be off tarps or tents. Probably people camp here at some stage. Roofing nails, the heads. Fishing sinker. Another fishing sinker, two coins, a 20 cent piece, the shilling, 100 years old, so really wrapped about that, 1979, 100 years old, brilliant. The old tap, looks like a solid brass, it's an old one, just don't know how old, it might be just off a, actually off a barbecue or something, so we'll clean up and have a look. And this, I, I've got a feeling that's off um, a valve stem. But I'm not 100%, so I could be totally wrong. So we'll clean it up. Great spot here. If you have a look around the park, you can see we're up on the banks of the water. Guys, that's the male turkey over there I was telling you about before. Australian bush turkey, scrub turkey, whatever you want to call him. And I know we've already done the wrap up, but where the chair was, I thought I'd better just do that before we go. And of course, there's a signal right under the chair. It's not the best signal, but we'll have a look. 
She got a good middle. That's what it is. She got a good middle. 